Okay, that's not a Nissa, but it's something. There is no Nissa on this. I know. I know, but you wish there was. Daddy? Really? Do you think I would get those? Okay, maybe not. <laughs> oh, that deck also had Vorin Plex. Oh, yeah. Oh, we, we totally were messing. That was the one we oh. were messing with your opponent. Yeah. Oh, big time. Yeah, that was really oh, good. With Vorin Plex against a Crystalline Giant? Yeah. They just don't get anything. Like, that Crystalline Giant got a plus one. Hello, PJ. How's it going? Nope, like, you're not getting any more. And hello, Blastinos. Blastinos says, I changed up my elf build to add the crater hoof as you do, and I'm now ranked at about 460 in Mythic. Oh, wow. Wow, Blastinos. That's awesome. That is. And Slice of Scott is, Thank I believe, our first 10-month subscriber. Thank you, Slice of Thank Scott. Thank you, Slice of Scott. That is awesome. Mm-hmm. And Long John says, Greetings, Daddy and Dana. Happy Saturday. Boston says, Thank you. By the way, sorry we were a little bit late. It was my fault. It was. I know. It's almost 4 o'clock, Daddy. I know, I know. It's really bad. Can I have gummies a little earlier? No, but nice try. But I would have to wait till 5 o'clock. It was before. It was still up closer to a quarter to four, ten to four, ten to four now. So, are you picking Teferi though? No? Slice of Scott says my pleasure. Well, we appreciate it. You know, it. it's illegal to have Vivian and Teferi in the same deck. Not really. It is. What if they're friends? Can't they be friends? They're not, though. They could be. They're just not. They could be. It's not. Oh, I, I had a game where they played Lanoi Visionary followed by Jason. I'm like, nah, that's illegal. Nah, nah, nah. Did you call Judge? <laughs> no, <laughs> Long John says it's always Daddy's fault. Yeah, pretty much. It really always is. Yeah, pretty much. Oh. A Shia? Or Tristani. <laughs> um, <laughs> or Gem Razor. But I think a Shia. You actually have good artifact removal. I think a Shia keeps you open because you might not go white. You might go what? I know you like green white, but look, there's good green I black, green, green red. red, even green blue. There's some good blue being passed to you. Very slight chance. Yeah, it's possible. A Shia does keep you open, and it's a really good card. Yeah. It's arguably, as as it's arguably even story. the best card between those. Um, Tall Rand is really good, too, but I don't think I'm convincing you to no, do that. No, you're really not. You're um, really not, Long no. Said, That's what happens when you don't know everything, and your child does, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Yep, Shia it is. Sorry, Trasani. Of course I get good, really good white in this pack. There's some pretty good white. And there's horrible blue. Horrible <laughs> green <laughs> Oh, uh, there was also another game where I cast Turn Fork Wine Clacks. They packed that negation. They didn't have the mana, so they just lost. What? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's funny. They thought they had double blue, but they did Blastos says to take the disallow. What about the goose, oh. Dana? Yeah. Um, that is some good white, though. Yeah. Blastinos, I'm sorry. Dana's not taking that disallow over <laughs> the fact of negation. <laughs> Oh, interesting. <laughs> yeah. Oh, hello, Rabambi teacher. Oh, Felidar retreat with a Shia. Okay, <laughs> that's pretty good. Long time to see. Also, one of the lands teacher. might wheel. One of these lands. Yeah, that's true. Because you have there's two of them, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, partner in crime is here. PJ likes the binding. The binding of the old gods, or binding the old gods. I like the Felidar Retreat. I, I could see either of those. There's also the Mammoth, but I think at this point, that you know keeps you pure green, you have been seeing some decent white. 
Blaster this said, is a pit five felon our retreat. Yeah, it's true, but it is his cube. Uh, Blaster says for the April Fool's event, there's someone who played a deck of 40 packs of negation. Their game plan was to counter the first spell their opponent cast it seven times and then concede. Oh, that's pretty funny. <laughs> counter, I wanted, counter, to, counter, I wanted and then to play lose. a deck full of land war elves and lands. Yeah? You did play one that was, you know, like Lannies and Archdruids and Cocos, and that was pretty much it. <laughs> and Warmasters. Oh, yeah, Warmaster. I think Crater Hoof is in there. The Hoof. The Hoof. Okay, so let's think here. Um, you could do that. That could keep you on green. It's kind of like a half card a turn. There's also the Nightmare Shepherd for the Null Priest. Um, so that is another option, right? Mm -hmm. Hello, Bronze Panda. Hello. We are doing well. How are you doing? Right, Dana, we're doing well. We're doing, we're doing really well. well. I just drops. had a Slurpee. Oh, yeah, Q drops and Slurpee. It doesn't get much better, does it? It really doesn't. Yeah. <laughs> and since I twisted my ankle on uh, Wednesday during a hike, I, like, used the Slurpee as an ice pack. That's what I... And I didn't do that was when that I just first the best got Dana? the Slurpee because I was doing a practice for one math test. So that was pretty hard. And it was timed. Da elf. I don't know. That's not the best elf. Da elf. Yeah. You realize it's gonna be extremely hard to. Ah. Once Vader says, "Oh no," well, that's good use of the Slurpee. It is. It is. And Black Demon Man says, "Slurpees and gummies are better." No, Slurpee's oh, gummies. Oh, wait, 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 sorry. I, I missed one. Brown Spanish says, really good making pizza. But then Black Demon is saying Slurpees and gummies are better than pizza. You like pizza, but I think you would agree with that. Yeah. Um, so if you are going, I'm just wondering, do you want to take Thalia if you are going white? I mean, Fun Shaman may not be super exciting. But it kind of depends. None of those are super exciting. They really are. And none of these are actually all that exciting either. No. <laughs> I mean, there is heroic intervention, maybe. Um, Adonto Vanguard. Yeah, that's good. Adonto Vanguard could be a w worthy uh, consideration, Dana. Yeah. I don't know what you think. Um, oh, there's dogs next door, just like. <laughs> I think there's also kids. Yeah, they're going like crazy. Trying. Long John said the Slurpee explains Danish good <laughs> sugar high. Yeah, this is fair. I also have watermelon gummies, so, Let's you know. See. It's great. Um, there's been a lot of good black. I'm wondering if you maybe pivot to black. What do you think? There's been some good white. I like white. Okay. I'm going to take this just in case I might splash red. Um. Okay. That's a, that's a good option, actually, just to keep the, the options open. Hello, Lizzie. Thank you for the follow. Hello. Long John says, sounds like Annie has many friends. Good for her. No, it's not Annie, though. It's, it's not kind of Annie. next door, kind it's of across door. the fence and all that. So, Annie doesn't bark much at all. Although yesterday, Annie had a friend who was like, his name was Takis. Uh, and he like was jumping on her and she was like, because she didn't like it. And he was crazy. Do you want that or the all seed? I'll see it better. I could see an argument either way. I mean, lands are kind of good utility. Oftentimes, not clear whether you can afford to play the colorless ones, but okay, that that's not bad. Tristani didn't wheel, but you have a lot of ways to deal with uh, artifacts and enchantments. I do. Yeah, Tristani didn't wheel actually. Tristani did it. Yeah, gem razor is good. Sadly, Tristani didn't wheel. There's now I want. Watch me get another Hornet Queen. <laughs> yeah, you seem to like attract the Hornet Queens. Which is very ironic, actually. Yeah. <laughs> like, Giving I'm her... extremely afraid of bees. Yes. My sister had a friend over You're and I was fan. outside and it was, and there was like, there was like this bee that wouldn't go away and I'm like, ah, 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 oh. Ah, ah, ah. Ooh. Oh, maybe you do want to splash some black. Uh-huh. That's really good. Uh-huh. 
Yeah, Long John pointed out they didn't God, yeah. say, uh, yep, good call. Didn't say anyone was barking, only your friends were making the noise. Uh, that's a fair guess, although, again, these are maybe, they're not really, like, we have to, they're right next to our house, but the way the streets are, you have to go, like, all the way around. Hmm. Um, Black Demon Aaron went 6 3 with Mono Green, and also had Hornet Queen. Ooh, there you go. So, two 6 3s there. Well, you could end up going green, black, uh, splash, white. To be totally honest. There's a lot of good black, but again, now you're going the other way. It's just interesting to keep those open. Oh, there's... Oh, interesting. Bronze Panda is pointing out Sigrid is awesome. Sigrid is good, but I think... I think that was the pack you got... Kaya. Is that, is that the pack you got? Kaya? Yeah. I can see Sigrid there, because it doesn't take you in the black. Kaya is just such a bomb, though. Especially because Kaya is just all legendary. So if Vivian dies or Shia dies. Yeah. Okay, so what do you think? Wow. Have you seen Reach Car over Lanny? Uh-huh. There's also, also Lanny is more likely to wheel. That's true. Like, to be fair. There's also the inscription. There's Dreadhorde Invasion. Reach car. There's a Maria's Call. Reach car. Okay. You realize yeah, you're not talking car. me out of it unless you make a good point for Lanny. I'm <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Whoa, okay. I'm sorry. Yeah. That was quick. It, it, was that one for Shady? Was, yes. I'm white. I think there was a wrist in that pack. No, there, there was. <laughs> Elspeth. Yeah. Ooh, ooh. Round clock to, oh my god. Dryad to Black Demon Man points out. Hello, Kyoji. Okay, there's Tender Shoot Dryad, Verderous Gear Hulk, Cathar's Crusade. Round clock Dryad. Okay, I'm wondering <laughs> if you get the Dryad and maybe some, one of the others wheels. Because they're all doubles. I'm, I'm kind of thinking the others are more likely to. Yeah. Yeah, Long John says, oh, Sadie, good news. And then Sadie's not here. Is not we'll have to uh, tell her that you, you you didn't even pick, you snap picked. Uh huh. Yeah, you pretty much snap picked the. Uh, I'm white. I see Elspeth. I take Elspeth. Yeah. That's it's fair. a little different if I'm not white. Yeah. But I'm white. I see Elspeth. I pick Elspeth. Or, you know, it would be really hard. Elspeth and Kaiser. Or Elspeth yeah. and Vivian. Yeah, it was dry. Okay, dry it. Um, turn timber? Yeah. I like that. There's also seal away, but why? Well, I know I'm white now. But you pr you kind of know you're white. Um, Sorry, Gary. The turntable could be good, but hmm, it's either turn timber or seal away. Yeah. I guess turn timber is kind of like an extra card. Blastino says the land base in this cube is so good. There are a lot of good dual lands that float around. There are. This is very true. Oh, if Riss is there, pick, what is it, I think 10? It was, yeah, pick 10. Um, what do you think? Oh. Well, hold on here. There's a lot of options. There's the land. Do you go Yorion? Given how many playables that there are, do you go Yorion and just have like a big deck and you have Yorion there? Let's see, do you have stuff that goes well? Um, Rishkar, I have... I mean, you can pick stuff up. Oh, Elspeth. You Elspeth goes really well. Refresh that. Okay. Let's see what else there is though, Dana. Let's see what chat says. Because there is the dual land. There is the apparition. Yeah, Long John, it is a phantom draft. It so is. the draft cards are not added. That is correct. Okay. Scooters are area response. <laughs> oh, Rebombi Teacher clipped the Sadie pick. Thank you, Rebombi Teacher. We'll have to show Sadie. Uh-huh. Um, oh, shall I? So, okay, so now here's what's interesting. Land. Well, okay, you could get the land. If you think you're going Yorion as your companion, you are going to need more playables. So that means the lands aren't necessarily as quote unquote extra, but 
the land could be strong, but Scooze is a very strong card as well. Scooze is. You also want to look for things you can abuse with Yorion. Um, so you keep that in mind. Scoots. Uh, is a Scoots. A Scooty Witty? I like Scoot, yeah. Ooh. Mortal son of this. Mortal son is so good, but at the same time, I have two planeswalkers. What's your mana? What's your mana curve look like? Yeah. A billion five drops. You do have a lot. And how many planeswalkers do you have? Uh, three. You've got. Elspeth. Yeah, that's true. So maybe this. That's a very good card. It's removal. Yeah. Oh, Black Dune was saying before, sorry, I missed that. Uh, I picked the land. Okay. It's Inscription did wheel. Yes. Lanny sadly didn't. I'm no, surprised Lanny this didn't. wheeled and Lanny did it. I know, you really would have wanted the... I really would have. Because you said, I'm filling out my study guide to study for tests on Monday. Reading my general code of operating rules reminds me that it was written by lawyers. Oh, yeah, sometimes that stuff takes a while to get through. So hopefully it goes relatively smoothly, Kyoji. Okay, so this is your, your pick 10. This is where we might see Riss, though it's probably unlikely. Riss, Rissy, Riss, Rissy, Riss, 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 Rissy, Riss, Riss, Riss. I want Riss, 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 Riss. I want Riss, 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 Riss. Spidey Whitey says, hi guys, hope all is well. Nice abs and death. Hi. Thank you, hello. And we think it's Abzan, it might not be. We'll have risk, to see. Risk, 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 <laughs> Koji says risk. Risk, risk or risk? We're risking the risk! <laughs> and there's a land though. Do you really think I'm taking a land over mm -hmm. risk? <laughs> like, Elspeth is one of the only cards that I take over. <laughs> Oh, the, uh, the, the, the token, uh, what's it called? Cathar's Crusade one? Mm-hmm. I think that didn't, uh, wheel, but... None of them wheeled. This was the pack of Banefire. Oh, Banefire. I think I recognize Banefire in it. But that thing's, you know, you do, did need some earlier stuff that I keeps did. you alive. I did. So do you think oh, you're going... Oh, Rizma Scootsworm, like, making a billion copies. Oh, <laughs> like you need more, but yes. <laughs> so do you think you're going to uh, go the Orion route? Probably. Okay. So if you're doing that, you need to make sure you have the playables. So how many playables do you think you need then with Yorion? Uh, Like... 34... Yeah, that's what I was going to say. 34, Right, because it's 50% bigger. Mm -hmm. So, yep, that's exactly what I would say. I just did the math. Of, since we went over it with your Yorion deck. I'm like, that's true, we did well, that Well, if we have 26 lands, 60 minus 26, there you go. Yep. Oh, Grave Be Breaker uh, Lamia could get um, oh. Elspeth. Oh, okay, that's not bad. Yeah. That's what you're gonna take, and it wheeled. Uh huh. I will say there's one thing with Yorion, Dana. Mm -hmm. You get to play more of your cards. Cutting is so much easier. Okay, there's good stuff. But I think I see. Yeah, I think it's hard to say no to the boat. <laughs> the flying boat? Black Demon Man says, but they're harder to draw. Yes, they're harder to draw. They are extra good stuff. This is true. Oof. There's also a shadow spear, but I think the boat is just the boat. The boat. It's now, what's your, uh, what's your curve look like now? Lots of do jobs. Yeah. Lots of do just That's of true. Jobs. You could kind of use fours. Uh -huh. And your curve's a little on the expensive side. So threes and fours are probably... Although that still pushes you up. But I think you does. You could use some ramp stuff. I could. Well, I do have... You have a goose. And I have a reach car. Oh, my... Yeah. Wow, oh. Oh, this was Riss. That's more likely to wheel. This? Yeah, most certainly. 
Well, but sort of body mind of the is most certainly not wheeling. That's not wheeling. There's also a stone coil serpent. Also not wheeling. And in Arketra's monument. <laughs> stuff might be. No, no, no. Those are kidding. Those are all getting taken. Subtle, maybe. I love monument. Kyoji likes the monument. I like the sword of body and mind. Yeah, the sword of body and mind. It... <laughs> yeah, that is good. It's really I good. I agree. Oh, there's so much good stuff. Hanged executioner. Like, don't forget that. Um, okay, sword it is, though. I can't fault you for that. How are you on creatures? Oh. <laughs> well, although keep in mind, right? You're looking for 50% more, so you're looking for like, you know, 20 something creatures. Um, <laughs> it was time I did. Okay. <laughs> Spider Wayne says, I love me some wrinkle. Yes, although I think in this deck, you're more just splashing black. Uh huh. There was no way I was taking anything other. Yeah. I have. I have two wells. This is true. And Risk can be making even more. This is very true indeed. And Johnny has all the packs. Um, <laughs> nice try, but you. Oh! Okay. That stuff to uh, reuse with Yorion. Oh, God. Ew. Oh, ew. Okay, but that is a five drop, you know. So. Just saying. It's also a conquer's death. I know exactly what I'm going to name this deck now. No, I... Now I know exactly what I'm gonna name this deck. <laughs> this one's for Sadie. Uh huh. Ooh, that one's good. Glass casket. It's like no, there's nothing that amazing in this. That's some nice early removal. There's also the Guardian Idol, which is um, Ramp. The Glass Casket has a small chance of wheeling. I'd be tempted on the Guardian Idol, just given how much expensive stuff. Um, Jace Meister said the land could be great. Karn's Bastion could be really good, too. You do have a fair number oh, of counters. Okay. I can't, I mean, you could have made the case no, for I one of those. This name is going to be the stack name. You know yeah. what I did? The sad Sadie, sad Elspeth. It's going to be happy Sadie, happy Elspeth. Oh, I like that one. Uh, Black Demon Man says, you're already your turn three play if necessary. That's true. It doesn't affect the board. But yes. <laughs> Long John's like, Sadie. <laughs> Honestly, one of the lands would be pretty oh, good. Oh, Triumph. Uh-huh. Yeah, uh, Black Demon Man uh, points that out. Uh, oh, yeah, that triumph is perfect. Uh -huh. oh. Sorry, Ulamog. Although you're really expensive. <laughs> you know what I want? What? Marari's Wake. Ah, that would be really good. Although it's getting kind of late for it. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's see here. Garrick is good. The Sawtust Demolisher. But you know what? That's non-creature and you have a lot of stuff to deal with that. It's also Bonder's Enclave. Okay. I can see the Garrick. Yes, by the way, he likes to try on. Oh, you know what, Dana? In here. Remember we had this a little bit, but you might want to... Uh... All right, let's just leave it for now. Leave it for now. That's fine. Um, do, do, let's do, see. Do, do, do. Uh, yeah. There's that. The Spice says, demolish channels to hit your own stuff for some more beatdowns. That is true. Get in 3-3 three, three from a 1-1. One, one. Do you like that or the pouncer? Charming Prince. Okay. And Charming Prince goes, uh, 
Well, Sadly, no, on. our R is weak. No. Warren Plex would also be really good. Uh, God's willing. Nice cheap protection, maybe? Yeah, the, I mean, the sword is good, but you already have a sword. And having too many of those can be kind of clunky. Mm -hmm. I could see that. Oh. oh my god, so much good stuff wield. Uh -huh. Okay. Wrangle's good, but again, it's double black. Yeah. The monument. Oh. I, I will just point out, it goes well with like wrists and stuff and making that, but the hanged executioner is removed. Also goes well with wrists and. It goes well with wrists and Yorion. That's true. Saroof! Saroof? Spidey Whitey said the monument's strong. Yeah, the monument is very strong. Wow, there's a lot of good cards in there, Dana. Saroof! Too bad you couldn't take more of them. Ow, ow, ow. Really? Yes. <laughs> Nissa definitely is not hogging all the packs. <laughs> nope, not at all. Yeah, and this is most certainly is. Nope, a not at all. Facts. Wandering Omens says, looks like a sweet deck so far. Thank you. Thanks. Yeah, this was kind of interesting. I might not actually have enough cards for Dorian at the moment. I don't, really? Maybe not. Not at the moment. Well, I haven't added lands, so. Well, click on that. Click on the, the little thing there. 33. 33. Okay. I need to add one. Oh. Hmm. You know, this could be abused with Yoyan. Jace Meister says you need three more. Oh, wait, cause, is it counting Yorion in there? I don't know, it might. Let's see, what is it? Uh, I mean, you could kind of go land heavy, but that may not be the best. Um, oh. We could just play Yorion, too. Well, I do have stuff that cares about land. Like, Scoots the Loose. And Felder Retreat. And Felder Retreat. Yeah. And a Shire. Although not so much Shire. And then Wandering Omen, we will get you a Coco Code. Hmm. What are your options here, Dana? Double I think you blocks. were on track but then you just I just didn't get stuff. there wasn't as many but here click on that click on the graph Dana let's let's see here for a second here okay so you have 33 I don't know if it's counting your companion let's see so oh right. black demon points out neutralize could be two mana draw a card it's true Is there a serpent here? Nope, it's not counting Yorion. No, because what is Yorion? Bird, Bird serpent? Bird serpent. Okay. And if there's no serpent in creatures here, that means it's not counting Yorion. Okay. So 27 land out of 60 is like 18 out of 40, right? Because you just take two thirds. At plus I have this. You do have that. Maybe I do do this. Yorian is in your sideboard, Black Demon Man says. Yeah. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, because that's how it's kind of structured. Yeah, Gary is just as not impressive. Mm -mm. Well, I guess this could be abused with Yorian. Yeah, but I don't know. <laughs> yeah. <gasps> Neutralize, I guess. Uh, you know, I mean, the, the land is not a bad option either. I don't know. Yeah. It's up to you, though, Dana. Now the land. land <laughs> any power any power. excuse to not play neutralize, even if you never intend on to... Uh-huh. 
<laughs> and do you want to go the Yorian route, or do you want to? Uh, I mean, no, you can always go route. Yorian main deck or something. And no, Yorian route. That? You want to go the Yorian route, okay? Yeah. Demonic pack literally says you lose the game on it. This is true. <laughs> All right. Well, you should make your land drops at least this way. Uh huh. Yes. And your curve is on the expensive side, right? It is. Plus, I have lots of things that care about Although, land. you do have goose and all that kind of stuff. I have no. things that care about land. All right. All right. Let's count. Okay. Let's start with green. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Um, 11, 1, 2, 8, 9, 10, 11, all right, black, 1, 2, 3, um, I think I just need that, and then white, I'm actually more white than green on this deck. You kind of are. And username password says hello. Look, hello, you, username password. Actually, I have more green cards than white. Oh. Okay. <laughs> All right. One. Well, you're two, very green and white. Either three, way. four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Wandering Omen says thank you so much for the code. This is a wonderful stream. Well, thank you very much. Yeah. And glad you're enjoying yourself. We have fun, don't we, Dana? We do. Now Especially I need to add a bunch dropped. of land. So let's yes. add two of you. And then... Wait, you need to add that much? Probably just that. When I'm just saying this covers your color requirements? Yep. Really? This does. No? Oh, okay, then. Well, I didn't count this as triple green. Oh, I see. I don't know. It could be, but I think that's more likely going to be a spell. Okay, so then... PJ River says, did you know you could give Demonic Pack to your opponent just before you reach, you lose the game, and they lose the game? Yeah. Okay, now this if you have the right cards. color requirements. Okay, that meets the color requirements? Uh -huh. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, boop. And then, maybe just add those. And that. And then the name. And the picture. And Stealth 300 will get your Coco code. Not a question mark. Not that either. There we go. All right. I'm. Sorry, Tivar. Stealth 300 says, uh, I love you guys. It's nice to see such a wholesome stream. Oh, Dana? thank you. Thank you. Jace Meister. We'll get you the code. Oh, man. Oh, it's too long. <laughs> Fur? First. Are you sad about that, Dana? Yeah. Happy Sadie. Sadie and Elspeth. Awesome. Since happy Sadie, happy Elspeth. It's too long. All right. Let's play. Could it please be 
seven minutes till gummy time. Okay, maybe. Yay! Since it would, or it could be like maybe ten minutes till gummy time. Ten minutes maybe. till gummy time. Yay! Yay! Gummy time! Hopefully <laughs> a little sooner. Oh God, I want a green man. Nah. But I don't need it early on, so maybe I can do. Are we going to risk it? Do. Okay. Maybe I can, like, I have turned two and three white stuff. And I don't have, and I don't need green until turn five. So. I don't think I need my yogis since I just have a Slurpee and as you know, Slurpees are extremely filling. <laughs> they are actually, this is true. <laughs> like they're really filling. That's why I don't want to have it like right before dinner or right before lunch. Oh, and it looks like we have another uh, certainly not right before Utrecht. breakfast. We'll get you the cocoa code. But you really need green. I do now. Well, to be fair, Tyvar is a five cost because Thalia is all things. No, oh, that's kind of true. <laughs> and then uh, Wonder Boy says hello, Fishers. Look at all those good blue cards like Sphinx's Revelation. It's true, you could, could have splashed blue for that. Midnight says, hey there, just thought I'd drop by for a bit. Good to see you, Midnight. Good to see you. Yeah, Wonder Boy liked your hand. Midnight says, can speak from experience, I agree. Dark Flame Ash is morning from Australia. Good morning. KJ says, if you woke up in Bizarre world, world and there wasn't any stipulations, how many gummies can you eat within an hour? Hypothetically, of course. <laughs> <laughs> like if you're just maxing out on gummies, although we don't want to see that. You really don't. Jace Meister says, opponent can't believe you're running your constructed deck in draft. Yep. Oh, there is a green. Well, there's your three drop with Yorion. Mm-hmm. All right. Yep, James Meister said, don't forget Honestly, to Honestly, if Midnight. I just ate gummies nonstop for an hour, it would probably be around 50 to 100, but I wouldn't. That could that be. that would be a lot, even for me. Yeah. It probably would end poorly. Uh-huh. Oh, okay, you've got interesting uh, choices here. Tender Shoe Dread, I think. Yeah, to kind of get the stuff going. Uh huh. Cause you don't have anything to like smack. Honestly, I don't want one. <laughs> um, Rusty Shackelford, thank you for the cheer. Says yeah. Tony Hawk tried to become a politician near me, but he didn't get far. He spent too long skating around the big issues. <laughs> Do you know who Tony Hawk is? He's a pro uh, pro skater, skateboarder. <laughs> uh, okay. Rusty Shackelford, reliable for the puns. Thank you. That wasn't pun slash joke. So that wasn't a pun. It was a joke. The um, boat. The boat. Yeah. Well, now the boat doesn't have a target at the moment, um, but it still is so out I there and it's a boat. Attacks. Now hold on, hold on one second though. I think there's a decent chance they have a counter spell. Attack first. Um, yeah, listed points that out too. The blue mana is up. A, you may want to attack first. B, you may just want to keep that in mind. So maybe attack. Um, maybe Tender Shoe Dryad stays yeah, home. Yeah, maybe Tender Shoe Dryad stays home. I, I just worry because they have five mana and did nothing. Mm -hmm. There you go. Oh, this is so key. Now you can boat. Ooh. Oh! Okay, that worked out so well. <laughs> oh my god. Robbie did not appreciate Rusty Shackford's joke as much. 
Midnight says that seemed aggressive. Yeah. Okay, then. That to works. To be fair, they were dead on board. Th this is fair. Oh, Yorion could flicker the boat if it doesn't want to attack. So then it just deals three to another thing yeah. that doesn't have to attack. If like, there's not a good attack. And by the way, right, they, they um, block. yeah, Midnight saying like it was kind of like desperate of them. They just spent five mana to get rid of Thalia. Yeah, that hand did turn out really, really well, Wandering Omen. See? He, oh, Wonder Boy got a new computer, and tomorrow I need to clean my room to put up shelves and then put up my new computer. Ah, oh, my dad's so getting I'm getting a new one soon. Because his computer's Yeah, up. it's coming what? apart, kind of, and it's kind of old anyway. Yeah. Um, Kyoji says, I beat Brian Weissman a couple of years ago. I talked to my coworker. It was like if he met Tony Hawk. He replied, I know Tony Hawk. He's a good friend of mine. I have his number and been to, how, been to his house many times. Ooh. Yeah, Brian Weissman, Dana. Have you heard that name? That's from the very beginning of Magic. A lot of, like, early, early theory. Blast Dennis wants to know what uh, computer one boy got. We did a lot of work when we were figuring out yours. Ooh, Sadie would like this hand. Sadie what? So this, this is actually a good, good hand. hand. It's a pretty good hand. It's a pretty good hand. Because you know what? You can hang the executioner. You can gem you can do a bunch of things with this. Well, to be fair, gem raiser on the token, it is like flying reach and trample. I know. <laughs> flying reach. I know. It's pretty good. Flying and reach. Well, okay. <laughs> the reach is like a, but it's a, it's a big flyer. It's a big flyer with trample. Oh, that's right on time. It kind of is. Pretty good. Scry. Yeah. I don't need the life. No. Sorry, Kai. I don't have the mana for you. No. But you are pretty but good, Rissy. Rissy. Decent, yeah. Uh, Blastos says, what computer are you planning on getting? Um, I am get, was, I don't have too much of a choice because it's kind of standard through work, but it, it, it actually does seem like it would be pretty cool. It's the uh, Dell Precision uh, 5550 is, I think, the model number. Um, it's sort of their mid-range workstation laptop. It seems pretty cool though. It's pretty slick and pretty light and pretty powerful. So, the one thing I will say about it, I don't know if anyone here can relate. Nana, I think knows this. Is oh god. Oh, ever god. since I got a laptop, I've had a track point or touch point. You know, little nub. He calls it stick. his pointing. It's stick. the pointing stick. <laughs> but they changed them, and the new ones don't have that anymore. So I have to convert from that to a touchpad. So I'm trying to get used to a touchpad instead of the track point, pointing stick, mm -hmm. track point thing. So I don't know if any of you have made that transition and can speak to that, but uh, hopefully it won't take too much getting used to, but a little concerned. No blocks. Okay. Wandering Omen says, I can never get used to using those old nubs on laptops. Okay, see, I'm the other way because I've always used those. Elspeth. Yeah, you could do that. Elspeth. Well, can you protect Elspeth? Are you just going to create some one ones, or? I can create some one ones, and then if Elspeth gets like really, okay. really low, you're. You could also, by the way, I will just point this out. You could attack and then get rid of this roof. Uh, you could do that. You could also Yorion and Riss, like bring Yorion to your hand and Riss. Um, you have a bunch of options. I do. Um, I like to, I actually like attacking with things, and then after that, hang, hang the executioner, get rid of the roof. Okay, if you want to, yeah, and roof is is a threat. But, no doubt about it. But since hang the executioner does not have to tap, let's get in. Now I will point out they just ramped, and they could do something really big after that, but. Tsuruf is also a threat. Tsuruf is a big okay, threat. Uh, Kyoji says, when I started playing EDH, my LGS store owner gave me an article written by Brian about card advantage. It was written in the early times of the game, and it still applies to magic today. Yeah, he was really, like, ahead of his time on things. It was pretty cool. Two. Ooh, that's really good. Um, Listen says, I have the 5540, and it's very nice. Oh, okay, that's good to hear. All right, what do you think here? Elspeth Riss. 
I can see or that. gem razor. Uh, oh, that's yeah, Shadow Sphere. I kind of like the gem razor. Yeah, mutate on the Charming Prince. Because, like, you really want to be in a position to protect Elspeth. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, I like that. Wait, mutate on that or the spirit? Oh, yeah, maybe it's spirit, actually. Oh, wait, this is a human. Oh, you can't anyway. <laughs> there you go. And Blasto says, oh, wow, that seems like a good computer. I'll, it'll play the heck out of some arena. Oh, yeah, it's more than capable of that. It's definitely got the power. Listen said just buy a mouse. Yes, and I actually do have a mouse. There's just certain times when, like, I know, Dana, you like to, like, you know, be on the couch or in bed or all that kind of stuff, where it's not that. I mean, I guess I could use, you know, you know that little, like, desk thing, the portable desk thingy? With the cushion at the bottom, oh, you use yeah, it to like do math. I could use that as well. There's just certain times. Well, it's not I don't quite as like convenient. that at all. No, that's kind of scary. It's really scary. Yeah. Oh, there's a. I actually have a good question. What? With Gem Racer, if I flicker it with Yorion, will the um cards come separate? Like. <laughs> Oh, uh, well, I think so. Although there's a token underneath, so the token won't come back. Yes, I do think it, it separates it out, I think. Okay, you definitely need to be staying alive. I do. Yeah, Rabombi teacher says touchpads make me uh, rage because I have fat fingers, so, I, um, so my cursor flies across the screen. Yeah, I think that aspirant is the biggest threat. Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, big time. Well, Tristani would be nice, but you can't do anything about uh -huh. that. Elspeth? I think you Elspeth now. Of course I Elspeth. She's Elspeth. Why would I yeah. Elspeth? She's Elspeth. 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 Yeah. Elspeth. Ooh. Create one ones and set up for Riss? Uh-huh. I think that could work. Actually, next turn. Oh, wait, no. I'm not quite able to do Now, is Gem Razor staying back, you think? I think... I think Yeah, well. I kind of think you want to try and protect. Mm hmm Because, again, you can do a lot. Of, like, next turn, you can risk. Well, next next turn, I'm going to get Yorion to hand. That, too. Oh, you can definitely see. So that when Elspeth, like, gets low, I just kind of flicker. Yeah. With Yorion, and then Elspeth goes, boom. Yeah, Rambi teacher, I, I take my mouse uh, all the time as well. Again, it's just certain situations it's a little tricky to, to use. Oh. Um, that was bad. That's really bad. Yeah, okay, that's, not, that's, that's, that's not good. That's extremely bad. Wow, three, four fours that are really five fives. That's not good. Well, hold on, hold on a second here. Let's. How are you going to deal with the three five fives? Um... I guess you kind of need Yorion sooner rather than later. Uh, yeah. Honestly, I have no idea how I'm going to deal with them. Okay, but Yorion is at least a flyer. Uh, yeah. This is just tough. Use Elspeth. Yeah, create use Elspeth. The one -ones. Create the one ones. Elspeth's dying anyway. Or they just go for your face. That would hurt. Yeah. I mean, if I were them, I'd do that. You're, you're happy to have Elspeth. Uh, well, yeah. I don't have anything else in my graveyard. So. Yeah, true. But I mean, still fine, right? Uh-huh. Pass turn. Wonder Boy's getting a gaming laptop. That's cool. Or a gaming machine. I forget if it was a laptop or not. That's cool. Oh, it's a desktop Wonder Boy's getting. Okay. Yeah. Desktops have plenty of power. Mm -hmm. You thought about getting between a desktop Rot and a laptop. Bro, big problems. Oh, wow. Yeah, so they have that, green. Maybe. Ouch. They have all five colors. Yeah. Big problems. Yeah, that's a challenge. <sighs> Lissid said, so what I like about the touchpad, you can use two fingers to scroll. That is nice, Lissid. Four pinch fingers to close, a lot of touchpad shortcuts. Yes, that is true. Oh, Midnight is saying they do separate, by the way. But in this case, it doesn't matter because of the token. I'm behind on the chat, sorry. Um, Wonder Boy said, bought what my brother re recommended. Yeah, we got advice uh, from Duncan Can't Die. 
advice us on our machine. Give us a lot of good advice. Yeah, they're going up my face. Cause... Oh, Jay's pointed out you could gain life with Elspeth. Or you could have. Although the tokens, are... yeah, I think at that point, maybe the gaining life would have been the play there. Are they going for your face? Yep. Yeah, you got to block the gem razor. <sighs> Sad. You definitely need to. Even something. gaining the life, I still have to block the gem razor because it's yeah, damage. Yeah, opponent is pretty good. Eric, Eric, we'll get you a Coco code. Well, this I'm one is kidding. not looking so good. No, it's really not. It's really not. Yeah, that Star Name Unleashed was very, very powerful. Uh huh. And rude! I think those two. Which two? Elspeth and Charming Prince. Yeah. Yeah. Although, I don't know how you live anyway. But you can get a bunch of life. Maybe you do live. Or maybe not. No, I don't. Oh, no, Casket. Casket can kill an angel. Jace Meister. Oh, thank you, Jace Meister. Right? Like, they get that back. But it gets rid of an angel. Oh, and can you... Put two counters? No, I can't. Oh. No, but you can put two counters on it. Yeah, so that's bigger. I think you kind of need to. Well, you're doing stuff. I am. Wondering says you could fight Tristani. And then they're just four. Oh, oh you could have yeah. fought Tristani. And then they're four fours. That would have been better, probably. Would, probably. Yeah. Oof. And no decks. Yeah. Oh, when they attack. Oh, Jace Meister. That would have been real. Oh, wow. Jace Meister with the great ideas. Actually, when they attack, that would have actually been worse because then it would have had the one damage marked on it. What do you mean? Uh, it would have had oh, you're right. Oh, you're right. Oh, that's a good point. And that's then died to the angel. That's a good point. Sadly, I don't get an activation off of those, but actually, I'm still dead. Oh, that's right, because it came in at the end. Oh, so you couldn't. Oh, yeah, you couldn't gain the life from it. That was tough. That was. Yeah. Well, when they get three, five, five, five angels. Yeah, Jace Meister, um, I think the plan was to fight the Drastani on Dana's turn. So then... So then it wouldn't have the damage marked on it and be a four, five. And I would have lived. Yeah. Okay, well, that was an, some interesting decisions that there. Was, they still had goals they could activate, so it still wasn't looking good. Yeah. All right, since it might go to... Since it... It is gummy time, actually. Yes. How do I get gummies? Well, casting Elspeth and Elspeth... How about... So it's cast a Planeswalker, Elspeth conquers death. Planeswalker or Elspeth conquers death. Okay. A Planeswalker, Elspeth conquers death is the gummies? Uh, and something else. Yeah, because you have actually a lot of cards in this deck. I do. Um... How about Planeswalker, Elspeth Conquers Death, or anything that costs five or more mana? Sure. How's that? I don't think that's too many. Well, Hopefully not. Then it would just be Planeswalkers, and I think that costs five or more mana. We don't have to add and Elspeth Conquers Death, because it's five or more that's mana. That's true. Planeswalkers are five plus mana. Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> Black Demon says whenever land enters the battlefield. <laughs> By the way, thank you, Jace Meister, for the good suggestions you know, on You know, I like that Black Demon land. Although my dad probably Black Demon Man says five plus mana or Tyvar. Or Clinton's Walkers. Well, I'll put this four mana and I have to get Yeah, half for mana. Sadie. <laughs> I kind of have. So. Okay. Elspeth from Graveyard. 
No, and cast spells. But uh, just cast. Are you getting spells. both? Yeah, because technically escaping okay. is casting all spells, so it's just cast all spells. Fair enough. Where else? But they enter the battlefield, and it, well, technically, when they enter the battlefield, if it's a spell that can enter the battlefield, I get the gummy, and if it gets countered, I still get the gummy. Okay. Oh, I like this hand. This hand's pretty good. Yeah. I mean, you can use some land, but you'll find some land. I have this. Yeah. Um, and then, like, reach car. And I got a land. Perfect. Turn four, Vivian. Turn four, Vivian. Turn four, Vivian. Beard custom age will get you the Coco Code. Turn four, Vivian. There's your Coco Code. Four, Vivian. Turn four, Vivian. Hello, Nameless Elf. They have the same sleeves as me. That's kind of cool. That rampaging Barasadon is kind of sad. I think I also cast Riss. Okay. I can see that. Ramping up, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, with all the planeswalkers I have, um, like, Vorinplex would have been so good. Oh, sad. No turn four in the end. Oh, but turn four fell at our retreat. Honestly, I think I attack with the... Black Demon player. Man says Rampage and Frostadon says no to Scoots. Yeah, that does make it a little tricky. You oh, want to yeah. kill yourself. <laughs> it makes Riss a little careful, too. Yeah. I want to kill it. So, oh, wait. Jace Meister says it could be worth leaving uh, Black to trade with uh, Dino. Well. Yeah. Trade one of those for Dino? Actually, I would trade Riss for Dino. This oh, yeah, trade Riss. Uh, yeah, I mean, Riss isn't that great with the Dino on there. I think that's fair. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah. It's hard to say, Jace. I agree. End turn. Yep. This monster says the same thing, you're losing the thing to that thing with what you have in hand. Yeah. You, the Rampage for Asadon is unfortunately very good against you, Dana. Just trying to point out, it's bad if they have uh, removal. Vivian's a gummy on two levels. Oh, sad. <laughs> Oof, that's I'm unhappy. Activate the ability. Ooh! Do you like Elspeth? It's not as great against that uh, for Asadon. For Asadon just does bad things to you, but... It's still Elspeth. Okay. Well, no, it it will stay on top. Okay. It's not a scrap. Oh, that's true. That's it true. It's not a scrap. Top. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nothing you can do. It. Okay, that's fair. But creating the one ones isn't so bad. Doidox, we will get you a Coco Code. I mean, I take the damage, unfortunately. Oh, Kanata Live is raiding with a party of 21. Oh, thank you! Thank you! Hope you had a great stream, Kanata. So 
says, hope you have a fun time. It says, hi, hope you have a fun time cubing Dana. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Oh, Chris didn't want to attack? Are you playing to block? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, you do need to get rid of that. This is totally fair. So everyone, please uh, do give uh, Kanata Live a, a follow. They're great. We appreciate it. Yeah. That says, um, I did. I hope you have a, you guys have a wonderful evening. Okay, that's Thank really you. sad. Thank oh, you. That is so sad. Yeah, Jace says, given they killed you 2-4, maybe they don't have another kill card. Jace says, I love this cube. Lots to think about. Well, you'd love it more if it had Nissa. Okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. What about Clarion Spirit and then Thalia? Right? Ouch. I know. Ouch. Unfortunately, this is just... Do, do you want to gain life with Elspeth? Like... Yeah. Bye-bye. I mean, I kind of think... Sally Thalia does. Oh, no, you can't! I forgot about that! Oh. I forgot about that. Yeah, Jay's pointed out can't. Totally forgot about that. Oh, that really sucks. Ouch. We both missed that, Dana. Ouch. More opponents can't I'm be I'm sorry alive. for the suggestion. Wow, this deck is just mean. Uh-huh. Okay. How do you get out of this? By drawing lands, Jace Meister says. Yes, that is one way to get out of it. Do Charming Prince for the scry? I go to three. I mean, you do need lands. I do. Mm. Don't gain a life. I don't... I think Tyvar is what you need. Well, you wouldn't lose life from it. Land and then Tyvar? For sure. What do you think? Mm-hmm. Or Tyvar first? I mean, it's hard no, to land say. land and then Tyvar. Land, okay. And you can smack uh, Tybalt. Now, hold on one second. Uh, I guess just with the one. Mm -hmm. Okay, fair. Wandering Omen says, I'm trying to save her gold for Strixhaven next week, so it's nice to experience the cube through watching. Okay, well, glad you uh, are enjoying it. Yeah. I, I think you block. Yeah. I mean, they're going to do a damage, but there yeah. isn't much you can do about it. So they can trade it with Alia. Yeah. Which is actually fine, because since I'm drawing the land... Yeah, I'm Jace, it is a greedy attack. Or they do it at me. There you go. They do it at you. They kill me. Okay. It's sad, because if they killed Thalia, I would draw the land. I could cast Vivian, yeah. which is a gummy. <laughs> oh, yeah, you never drew your fifth land. I never did. Uh, oh, wait, well, did you have the gummy from uh, Elspeth? I did. Okay. So push-ups in? Yeah, I'll see, cause, uh, cause even oh, though- Oh, your I'm ankle, gonna... oh, you know what, you should not. Yeah, cause like you're pushing back, you're stabilizing with your ankle. Maybe, okay, just, maybe you kind of skip that then, that's right, your ankle yeah. is injured. Yeah, you want to go a little bit easy on that. Like, it's a lot better, but sometimes it's like, when I do something, it's like, rawr, on that, so, you know. Black Demon says hopscotch on one leg then. Yes, yeah, so anything you could do, Dana, let's think about this, that wouldn't... Yes, I do. No, hurt your ankle. Yeah? What are you going to do? Uh, some sit -ups. Oh, you can do some sit-ups. That's true. Yeah, sit-ups, you're not putting any pressure. That's true. Or, like, twisting it. Good for you, Dana. At all. All right. Doing some sit-ups then? Yeah. Okay. 
Oh, wow. It totally fuzzed me out, Dana, on the screen. There we go. That was weird. <laughs> like, you moved the green screen, and I think it created some, like, weird something. That was really weird. <laughs> Spidey Whitey says you can do sit-ups or push-ups on one leg. I'm oh, actually, you could do the push-ups on one leg. I'm doing this. You're doing the sit-ups? Okay. And I'm not, and I'm putting... Okay, that works. Sadly, I can't do any gymnastics. Really bad yeah, um, Wandering Omen, Dana has actually burned through a fair amount of gold and, and gems on Cube Draft, and although she's been doing well on a lot of it. So I don't think you've lost too, too much. My last Cube Draft, I got six but wins. It's not exactly the best returns, because you have to, like, what well, do you have to get? Five wins to break even on gold. And anything below that is losing a bit. So, yeah, it's more for the fun stuff. I think it might be the way Arena, like, gets people to spend their gold. Or one of many ways, I guess. But you don't mind, do you, Dana? I don't. It's gold well spent. It really is. Poofy22 says hi from the Netherlands. Also, Elves Rule, my favorite commander deck, is my Elf Token deck. Oh, well, thank yeah. you, Poofy22. I'm really sad with my ankle, because I'm like, I'm not able to do, to practice my gymnastics. Just sad. I know. And you like doing that, it's just, it's just good. All right, Dana, thing was on my what do you think? Can you do a comeback here? Yeah, <laughs> I hope, I think, maybe, yeah. probably. Locking Man says, yay, Netherlands, high five. You've not been to the Netherlands. I've not. I have. I want to. A couple times. I want to go to Amsterdam. It's your name, it's fun. Wait, what, did it just keep? Wait, what, what happened? What the what? I didn't even press anything. My hand wasn't even on the mouse. That was I didn't weird. see what happened. Maybe somebody else saw what happened or we can watch it back or clip it or something. That was weird. What the what? I mean, this isn't a disaster. It's not the best. It really isn't a, a disaster. A disaster. Uh, Wandering Omen says, yeah, I like to think I'm competent with draft, but it doesn't always work out. Yeah, this is very true. And it's actually a tougher return for uh, for this draft than others. I think I scry. Yeah. Oh, it's just, yes. Yeah, Poofy says, ha ha, high five back. Jay says this hand is great, though. It's not bad. I don't think I need that. Yeah, maybe other people saw that, too, if it was weird. And Wonder Boy says it's Watsy's way to I get you I to want spend gold. I think I swamp because just, just in case, like, I have all three of them. I like that idea. You can even argue for the other lane, but you don't need it too much. Oh, Wonder Boy points this out, that it's what's going to spend gold every time they put out the new set. They put out the cube before the new set, so you spend real money on the next set. Oh, interesting. Well, they do cube tinkerers cube in the next set. They've done it both ways. They have. Did you sword? And then next turn, a Danto. Oh, da the this. sword on a Danto is amazing. Uh-huh. Okay, yeah, I like that. Oh, that's amazing, actually. Because, like, then it has Indestructible. Oh, yeah. So they can't kill a creature. Uh, Pelizaeus says, um, no keep mulligan screen. Seems like a glitch. I've seen that happen before. Okay, so it's not just us. And then he says, of course. Or cube in general, or festivals, yeah. Ooh, this. They I'm have their ways. Cast this. Actually, oh, this. Well, now, hold. Oh, that on Taji? Uh-huh. Tajik is just a problem. Yeah, and you can still do a Danto Vanguard. I can. Okay. Oh, wait. What? Is that a... It's a clue. Clue. Okay. Got it. Okay. Fair enough. And pass. Um, okay. Wonder Your Nomen says, it's a very good point, Wonder Boy. I never thought of it like that. Yeah, that is a good point, Wonder Boy. Sadly, Burn now kills Adanto. But I have this that can get rid of it. Yes. Well, you could save Adanto if you needed to. If it's Burn. Bur no, not Burn. Because it's not. Oh, you're right. Because it. Soulscar Mage is there. Yeah, that's true. You could normally. But Black I, Demon Man says, I, I hope there will be Netherlands that. GP soon again. Any GP, actually. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Yeah, Wandering Omen says might want to get that Soul Scar Mage first. You do need to get rid of the Soul Scar Mage. Do. Well, if I get a land, I could do well. Yeah. Okay. 
anyway. This is like ouchy, but. Pass. Zeldonius, I think the opponent hasn't noticed yet he can kill the Adanto. Could be. Well, I don't know. They, they, they might not have the, the card in hand, right? Mm hmm. Yeah. Zeldonius said you need to fairground that Adanto ASAP. I agree. Thank you for the follow, Eric. Eric. Wonderboy said Thone is like eight bucks now. Interesting. That's gotten up there. Honestly, yep. I don't want to attack because they could still block and then I would have to... No, you don't. No, no. You definitely don't want to attack. Pass turn. Yep. Hopefully they don't get rid of the Fairgrounds Warden. Yeah, hopefully. Because that sort of body and mind on Adanto is pretty tough to deal with, although you're getting mm -hmm. low on life, unfortunately. Uh -huh. Okay. This is going to be an issue at some point. This is. Not this turn, but could well be next turn. A problem. What do they have? Lightning strike. Oh, burn. Dragon Berserker and Grim Lava Mancer. Wow. Well, they couldn't. At least they couldn't play the Grim Lava Mancer now, but this, that's a bit of a problem. Oh, more dogs next door. <laughs> Wonderboy said, "I also wish My I never." Turn. Sold me the Emrakul, the Promised Ends, or Ulamong the Ceaseless Hunger, because Emrakul's 55 and Ulamong's 80. A lot of things have really gone over the price. Um, I could do that and equip. Let's equip first. Do you want to equip? Okay. Adanto. Now I'm wondering, does Adanto attack? Because this, this kills him really quickly, right? The Sword huh? of Body and Mind. So... Adanto Vanguard attacks. Do you attack? Yeah. Yeah, because no, now it's a 3-3. Three, three. Yeah. Yeah, Honestly, Fairgrounds with attack? the sword probably stays home. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Oh, and hold on. Oh, you could do this. So, Wandering Omen points out you can equip the sword to the Fairgrounds Warden. After combat. After combat. And then it doesn't die to lightning strike. Uh-huh. Yes. That's a great idea. And you have the wolf to protect. Okay, so yeah, I think I would do that. And it just makes a big. That's a great, great, great thought, Wandering Omen. Enter. I love that play. Yep. Sadly, I don't have any gummies. <laughs> That's what you're worried about? Yeah. 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 <sighs> yeah. Murphy King say, says, you want to talk about good returns? I got Memory Jar and Gilded Drake for $30 four years ago. Okay. That seems pretty good. I don't know what those are now, but I think they're a lot more. Yeah. Yeah, Zelda only likes the milling 10 cards. Okay. It's not the worst. No. Oh, well, Memory Jar's 100 and Gilded Drake's a... 450 for Gilded Drake's Murphy Kins? Oh my god, I had no idea. Wow. Okay, that is nuts. This is the last turn they can play those, right? Uh huh. Okay. Just one or the other. So it's one or the other, not both. Mm -hmm. Okay. Which I mean is good for me. Yes, that little Donio. My dad also had them. They're not playing any of the, either of them. Oh yeah, the cradles. Uh huh. Yep. I played a lot during Saga. Yeah, they only say jump with the wolf, but don't need to jump. My turn. Okay, yeah. so. Um, so, how many cards are in their library, by the way? <laughs> so, Eleven. Yeah, so they, they're, they get close to dead if they let it through. Now, that said, they could just do a bunch of blocking and stuff with it. Um, don't do this if your dad is a man of taste. It will pay your university. <laughs> well, a lot of you play Legacy. Uh-huh. 
Okay. So you have what? Six mana? Uh -huh. Okay. So you can hang Executioner in Yorion. Or I could Garrick. You could Garrick. You could equip and do something. You could equip and Garrick. Uh -huh. um, Garrick gives Trample. Does Garrick give uh, Trample to everyone? Oh, yeah, you could. Oh, yeah. Sword on a Danto Vanguard. Give a Danto Vanguard trample. Oh. Um. Oh, wait, wait. But Jace is saying I think you need to play the Hanged Executioner. Yeah. I kind of like that, putting it on the... Uh, so why don't you do that, Dana? This? Yeah. I think you kind of like that. Because Adonis said Garrick is trample. And I think you were liking that, yeah? Mm-hmm. Well, Garrick's a gummy. Yeah, that's true. Wonder Boy says, is it Garrick or Garruk? I just thought it was Garrett. I'm not sure. Anyway, let's equip that. Perhaps, yeah, you gotta go quickly. Yeah, on the Dendro Vanguard. And activate Garrick. After that. Oh, I have to wait for that. Yes. Oh! Oh no, you had to do it before! Ouch! Ouch! Okay. Oh, or you could create a beast. At this point, you might want to create a beast. No! Oh, forgot about that! Well, we can do it next round. Yes, you can. And pass. Pass, or do you attack and just, maybe you just, yeah. No. Let's not worry about pass. it. Yes. Yeah, that's perfect. Oh. oh, you had to do a different order, and it was under the time pressure, too. Mm -hmm. Ouch! Yeah, it should have been before. That's the one thing I don't like about it. Really. I know. Yeah. And it's hard, too, during stream, right? Because, you know, we like to chat and stuff, and it gives us some time, but... I still got to go. Don't, don't, no, we, we, no thing to apologize for. Like, again, it could have been done. It just had to be done in a different order. And pass to attackers. Yep. Oh, now they can kill Garrick. They can. But then they're not hitting you. Okay, well, they're hitting you. Pass the blockers. Okay. And Smurfy King says, how does Dana perform under time limits and paper? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on. No, no, no. Not like that. Don't you want to do with the tutu? Oh, yeah. I think. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so Smurfy King asks how you do in time limits and paper. It's not really an issue at all. That's really not. Dana's actually a pretty fast player. Um, and so it's not an issue. It's just very different because you have time limits for the whole round. So, I don't think time has really been much of an issue at all. Ooh. Okay, that's going to hurt. I go three. Okay. Pass damage. Yep. So I told you I should block with the beast. Fair. <laughs> you knew they had that, huh? You somehow just knew? I knew. I knew I should block with it. Ouch. Oh, God. Uh-oh. Oh! Yeah. Okay, then. Well, then. Wow.